Hey there, I'm meteorologist Tom Kippen. Here's what's ahead here. We're looking at lake effect snow showers for the daytime on Tuesday, mainly in parts of the western UP and east of Munising. Otherwise, the next UP wide snow chance, and that's not the best one, comes on Wednesday behind that storm system. It does turn colder Wednesday night on into Thursday. Like, you're definitely going to need the winter coat type of cold. And then as we head towards the end of the week and into the weekend, it's lake effect snow along with cold temperatures. And in fact, by the second half of the weekend, we could be potentially looking at some really cold temperatures. Definitely a winter like feel by the end of the weekend or by the end of the weekend into the second half of the weekend. But for Tuesday, here's your lake effect snow, Grand Marais over towards Whitefish Point, and maybe in parts of the western UP. And then tonight, bottom part of your screen here, you can see clouds moving on in, could see some snow. And then also some lake effect snow may hang on Grand Marais to Whitefish Point. And then as we go into Wednesday, you can see the bulk of the snow staying south across the Wisconsin border and into lower Michigan. But we do get some snow. And then Wednesday night, as colder air begins to move in over Lake Superior, here comes the lake effect snow on a west to eventually northwest wind. And I wouldn't be surprised, east of Munising towards Grand Marais and Whitefish Point, we could see the snow locally add on up. So here's your extended forecast. First for Marquette, Marquette County, we're looking for on Tuesday, clouds and sunshine, highs around 30 or into the 30s, a snow chance for Wednesday, and then turning colder for Thursday. We'll have some lake effect snow showers, but I think the bulk of the lake effect snow is going to remain east of Marquette. And then as we go into Friday, clouds and sunshine for Friday, and then a snow chance for Saturday. For the eastern UP, this is where we're going to see a good amount of our lake effect snow across upper Michigan. We'll have the lake effect snow showers on Tuesday, a snow chance on Wednesday, and then Wednesday night into Thursday. Stay tuned. We could have some pretty good lake effect snow amounts in some localized areas. Friday, some lake effect snow lingers, and then Saturday, a chance of snow. Out of the lake effect snow we go into the Escanaba area. Tuesday, some clouds, a snow chance for Wednesday. Clouds and sunshine for Thursday and dry weather for Friday. But as you can see, highs for the extended only in the 20s and 30s. And you notice some of these low temperatures, especially inland, are definitely on the cold side, including here in the interior west where we could have some single-digit lows Thursday night Friday morning. Otherwise, it's definitely cold here in the interior west with highs in the 20s and lows at night, teens, maybe some single digits. And then back into the lake effect snow, we go in the Keweenaw Peninsula. We're looking at temperatures in the 20s for highs, maybe 30s for Saturday, and then lows at night, especially inland on the cold side. Thanks for logging on to our webpage, upmatters.com.